All right, so we got Fable Xbox Game Showcase because video. Now I'm pretty sure Fable came out last year, right? Or did it not? Like, did it never come out? Here's the thing. Uh -oh. Go on. I instantly knew this was Fable. Whenever this came on in the showcase. So, you want to know all about heroes, dear? Well, but I was like, you have come to the right place. Because uh, who better to tell you all about them than perhaps the greatest hero of them all? Who are you? Yeah. Who are you? There he is, in all his finery. Cheers. Cheers. What's up, bro? Uh, who are you, though? What's your name? <coughs> oh, you just... You disrespectful. Humphrey, the Ebalon's greatest hero. I never heard of him. Respectful. Never heard of him. I mean, sure, you get your mega fans. You I know who that is, though. My favorite person. You haters. It's like a fan club, but we hate you. Your uh, chances and uh, the occasional giant toad for some reason. But it's more than that. It's about. I know who that girl is. is you make. I'm a hero. I should do what I want. We thought you could save her. You know, it's your life and death stuff. That's what defines you. Uh oh. You know, really, uh, stays with you. Don't look at I me. I'm, one here, um, I'm just listening. I took her in when she had nowhere else to go. Welcome to the most exclusive club in all of Albion. Thought I'd get her out there, make the most of her gift. But you know what it's like when you're young and you have a point to prove. I tell you. This kid, she had it all. The skill, the talent, Ooh. the power. She was something else, all right. She was terrifying. So, yeah, I knew this girl once who made all the wrong choices. Humphrey. You know she can hear you, right? She's back. I instantly knew it was Fable, right? Pretty sure there's more. I'm going to fix it, this place. And no one is going to stand in my way. Coming 2025. Now, like I said before, there was, listen. Play it day one with Game Pass. Comes out 2025. Now, I'm going to be honest with you guys. I'm pretty sure that, uh... That like last year at around this time, there was like uh, trailers for Fable that I'm pretty sure that I reacted to. And I thought that the game was actually, I think I reacted to the gameplay trailer. I reacted to like the, uh, like the, tra like the original trailer. And I think, and I thought that it came out already, but I just never covered it. That's what I thought that happened. I thought that the game came out and I just never covered it because obviously guys, if you don't know, like, you know, 2023, man, I'm gonna be honest with you. That was one of the most like. Like, first of all, I love 2023 because I went through, like, a lot of, like, good things and bad things. Like, like I, like, that's how, that's how, I would, like, that's how I determine a year. You know, if the year's really good, then, you know, like, obviously great. But if the year's really bad, then I'll be like, dang, okay, this year was horrible, but I'm going to keep going. But if the year was, like, really good and really bad and I learned, like, a bunch of things in that year, then, bro, that's a really good year for me. So, YouTube-wise, bro, like, oh, my God, that was one of, that was, like, YouTube wise, 2023 was like like the busiest year for me, bro. Because and, and I loved it, you know, because like you know, I obviously love putting out content for you guys and you know, getting new viewers and stuff like that. Like I love it. Um, and so there was so many games dropping. So you cannot sit here and try to blame me and be like, oh, how could you forget, bro? Like I don't want to make any excuses here, but bro, like 2023, like 2023 was like now, like right now. Like, there's, like, a lot of trailers coming out. There's a lot of games. Like, there's, like, a lot of, like, summer games about to pop out, whatever, da-da-da-da. This game is dropping next month. And, like, you know, I got Elden Ring around the corner. Um, I got, what else I got? I got um, uh, Black oh, Black Myth Wukong. That's dropping in August. Um, uh, uh, what else? I, I got the uh, Frank of the Casting Stone. I got that dropping. Um, uh, what was it? The Casting Stone? What was it? The Casting of Frank Stone? I think that's, I think that's, like, uh, that's the game's name. But, bro, I got, like, a lot of games dropping, right? And so, there's, like, there's so many games that, like, I need to, like, react to the cutscenes or whatever. Like, I, listen, I'm not trying to, like, sit here and make excuses. I'm just saying, like, bro, it's busy. So, if I forgot, like, about this game for a little bit, like, you know, my bad. But I thought that this game came out last year, like, after I reacted to, like, 
three, four trailers of the game. It turns out the game didn't drop. It looks like it looks like the game didn't drop. Um, it, it's coming out twenty twenty five. Um, yeah, I, I wonder like why they did that. Maybe it was you know maybe it was you know because of the layoffs. Maybe it, you know they wanted to change something up. Usually, like a lot of games do that. You know, if they want to change something up, then they'll like you know push it back far like you know further or whatever. Um, but at first I was like, wait a minute, is this Fable? Like no no shot they dropped two Fable games back to back. Like that's very like. Like, I would have been happy, but I'm like, wait, like, I thought this game already came out last year. Like, why would they drop, like, another one? Or maybe this is a DLC. Turns out, they did not drop that game, okay? They did not drop Fable. No, they're dropping it in 2025. Um, let, let's, let's just say this, right? I told you guys this, right? And I said 2024 is going to be like a... 2024 is going to be a really good gaming year. Obviously, you know, do, you know the, the bad about it is, like, the layoffs and stuff like that. But, like, 2024 is still going to be, like, a good gaming year. But 2025 is going to like 2025 is going to change the gaming industry forever. That's what I said. I, I said, mark my words. 2025 will change everything. It will change absolutely everything. 2024 will be like a it, it will be a, a like a good gaming year. It will be like a filler year, a good gaming year. But 2025, brother, will break. Oh my God! Like if you like if you're like a gaming channel, bro, and you cover games just like me, brother, you will be eating like next year bro like like you'll be eating now like you'll be full now but bro next year bro you're gonna want to lose weight bro because the amount of eating you're gonna be doing this year next year is absolutely crazy and 2024 has been going absolutely insane whenever it came to gaming um it's just obviously the the only bad part is the layoffs you know that's the only horrible part about it other than that man we got like a lot of you know we got bro this call of duty black ops 6 dropping later in the year we got the um the casting of frank stone i'm really excited about that game we got um what else we got dropping uh black myth wukong dropping later this year we got um i think we do we have doom is doom dropping this year i think we have doom dropping i think so i think we have doom dropping this year uh we got like a lot of good games dropping this year but 2025 will absolutely change everything so um i'm glad that a lot of these you know amazing games that you know that we look forward to is dropping next year because guess what i'm going to be there and you're going to be there okay it's going to be absolutely exciting Comment down below. What do you guys think about Fable? Um, listen, I said everything I needed to say in, in, in the last year trailers. It looks good, bro. It, it looks really good. This, I, listen, I'm gonna be honest with you, uh, bro. I don't. I, I, I listen. Respect to you, brother. But I, I don't know who you are. I, I, he was like, oh, you guys know who I am. I'm, you know, I, I'm, I'm the hero. I'm like, I'm like, you're who? I, I listen. I'm sorry. Listen, I don't want to disrespect, but I'm like. You're who? Like, what's your name, sir? I got, I got to, like, you know, go into history books in the eighth grade to look you up. Like, who? what's your name again? I'm like, wait a minute. I'm like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Like, before you slice me up with your sword, I know who this girl is. I know who she is. I've seen her before. Yeah, don't worry. I, I, I will not talk, you know, crazy about her. I know who she is. But, bro, like, until you show me something, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't, I don't. Listen. I don't know who you are. I mean, respect to you. You got the drip on. You know, you got the you got the uh, you got the diamond necklace on. I respect it. You know, but like you know, respectfully, bro. Um, we, we listen. I I came to see her. Yeah, I came to see her, bro. I listen. I'm sorry. You know, if you want to cut me up and you know do me like how they do me like how they did. You know, Romeo and Juliet. I, no, didn't they? Wait, didn't Romeo and Juliet? Didn't they? Okay, we're not gonna talk about that. <laughs> uh, oh, that's you guys. I didn't forget something about. Oh, subscribe to the channel and like the video if you guys are new. And um, peace out.